This is Quick Tips from the Metal Roofing Learning Channel, brought to you by Western States Metal Roofing, where you can find a variety of panel colors and finishes, all while saving on your materials by buying Factory Direct. Click on the link above to get started. Use of the following video content is subject to the warning, disclaimer of warranties, and limitation of liability as set forth on this screen. Clips and Panel Fastening The panel should be hooked onto the joggle cleat or bull nose eave trim and set in its desired position. A single pancake screw should be fastened onto the ridge side of the panel. This screw will temporarily prevent the panel from slipping down. Additional screws will be used to hold the panel during your ridge cap installation. Begin clipping your panel into place. Clips should start at a maximum of 8 to 10 inches from the edge of the standing seam sheet. We are using snap lock 1 and 5 8 inch clips. It is important to note that your exact spacing for your clip installation should be determined by an engineer. Spacing of clips will vary depending upon load requirements and local building codes. In this example, we are placing clips every three feet. Clips simply latch onto the male leg of the panel and are fastened with two pancake screws. Once your panel is fastened, the adjacent panel is installed by clipping the female leg onto the fastened panel's male leg. Prior to snapping in the adjacent panel, a bead of butyl sealant should be placed on the male leg one inch from the eave end. Then you repeat the clip fastening process. It's important to constantly reference your true squared lines to ensure your panels are going on straight. For a detailed video on how to square your panels, click the link above. Looking for more standing seam installation videos? Be sure to like and subscribe as we release new videos weekly. If you're installing a standing seam roof, then you will need to learn how to install gable flashing and a ridge cap. Check out these installation videos and more.